My name is Matthew McCraw, and I made a mistake. Hey family, welcome back to my channel. My name is Matt. If you're new here, welcome. If you're a returning family member, I love you. I know, blunt, right? So guys, remember to like, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, turn on post notifications, and support, support, support. I very much appreciate you guys. And you know, we're building this channel 1% at a time. Slow and steady wins the race. Let's go. So you may be asking yourself, Matt, what mistake did you make? Well, you're gonna have to watch till the end of the video to find out. I'm sorry, I had to. <laughs> now you're interested, now you're curious. Uh, you'll find out though, you'll find out. Yeah, so at the end, I'll talk about it. We're gonna talk about persevering through dark days. Guys, we all have bad days. We all have good days. We all have mediocre days. That's life, no matter how successful, no matter how intelligent, no matter how hardworking you are, you're gonna have a bad day. And I've had bad days. I've had a lot of bad days. I've had a lot of good days. I've had a lot of bad days. And I'm human like everybody else. I make mistakes. Obviously, I made a mistake. That was the first thing in this video. You're gonna find out what the mistake was at the end. You gotta stay. Now I got you. Sorry. I don't make the rules, but you wanna find out. I get up some days and I'm like, I'm overthinking. I'm like, is this gonna happen? Is that gonna happen? Is this gonna go wrong? Is this gonna go right? Why is this, why am I thinking like this? How is this going? Just why, you know what I mean? You're like, my biggest problem is I sometimes think about, okay, is the future gonna be okay? I have some lofty goals, I have some lofty ambitions, some dreams, some wants, and some things I wanna do in my life that are insane. They don't make any sense. So it's hard for me, I'm like, you know, you gotta say to yourself, when you want to be successful or when you want to do something in life, you got to do it. But it's hard because you're going to have these days where you feel like you're an imposter. And sometimes I have those days and we're going to talk about it together and kind of go through it and give you some solutions on how to work through it and, you know, work your butt off to overcome it. So guys, I'm going to talk about my little bit personal experience. We're just going to relate it, relate it to YouTube right now and then we're going to talk about other aspects that it could be in. So guys, YouTube. It's probably one of the hardest things to ever do in life, like ever. You know, you feel like an imposter when you start, and that's how I feel still some days. Today, honestly, today was one of those hard days. I woke up, and I didn't want to film. And I woke up, and I was like, ah, blah, I don't feel, I feel blah, I feel like, oh, I'm overthinking this, oh, is this gonna happen? Oh, I'm scared of this outcome, or whatever. But guys, like, I still did it, like, you gotta go through it. But we're gonna talk about, you know, that a little bit later in the video. But guys, you feel like an imposter sometimes. Guys, there's a never-ending fear on YouTube. Am I gonna get any views? Is anybody gonna like this? Is somebody gonna put some bad comment below? Am I not gonna get any likes? Oh wait, you should like this video. That Let's do that together. Sorry, it was a plug. Takes 2.3 seconds, let's do it. Like, like, like. Now guys, here's a picture of a really cute puppy. So, you're welcome. Also, the other fear is like, is nobody going to watch my content? Am I doing all this work, putting all this time in for nothing? Is it going to turn into a business? You know, yada yada, I can keep going. But there's a lot of fear, there's a lot of anxiety, there's a lot of mistakes that are made in any process, in any business. This is a business, you know what I mean? You know, in other businesses, you feel every day you're like, oh crap, is it going to work? Oh crap, is it going to work? I feel half those days. Today was hard, but I still did it. I still got through it. Creating the discipline to do stuff on the days that you're feeling bad, down, not, not at 100% is like how you build your character and how you really become the best version of yourself. Now guys, this does not just apply to YouTube, right? We're going to apply it to different things. First of all, school, work, a business, starting something new, going to the gym. Let's say you took a gap year off from high school and you're going into college and you're scared. You know, you have all these questions. Oh, am I gonna do well? Oh, is this gonna cost a lot of money? Oh, are the teachers gonna like me? Oh, can I do Zoom? Online, offline, is the campus gonna be open? You know, all these different fears and anxieties and mental hurdles you have to get over. And it's really, really hard. And I've had that too with classes. You know what I mean? When I was like, am I gonna pass this class? Am I not gonna pass this class? Does this teacher hate me? Does this teacher like me? You know, I gotta buy these expensive textbooks. It's hard, you know? So there's a lot of overlay with having a bad day or you have a test or you fail a test or you get a C on a test 
and you're scared. You're like, oh, is this gonna affect my grade? You, your mind just goes insane, and it's really hard to combat that. And I've had those days before. Now, guys, the next one, work. You know, what if you have a family, you have a kid and a husband or a wife, and you gotta support them, and then they're, the manager's like, oh, we gotta cut down because, you know, we've lost revenue, or, you know, your position has been terminated, or you're gonna have more time to yourself, which AKA means you're not gonna work here anymore. So, it's so scary, and in many different situations. So you can have dark days at, the, at school, you can have dark days at work, uh, some, starting something new, right? When you start something new, you're not gonna be good at it. You know, I'm sorry, put your ego aside, you're not gonna be good. When I started YouTube, I was trash, really trash. Now, I'm getting better, but I still got a long way to go. When I started college, I was, I was okay, I was decent, and then I got better as I, you know, kept going. When I started my job of five years, I was horrible at first, and then I got better, and then I got better and better. When I started my new job, you know, it's almost, I'm sorry, a year, so I've already been there for over a year, holy crap. But when I started that job, I had a lot of work to do, I had a lot of things to get better at, I had a list. You know, I wasn't perfect, I sucked. And then I got better, and I got better, and I can get better. You can always get better, you can always improve. And it's okay to have these dark days. Everybody has them, you're normal, I have them. I ha Today's one of them. Believe it or not, today has been one of them. So, you know, I'm human, you're human, we all make mistakes, we all do good, we all do bad, and sometimes we have bad days. And today I'm gonna try to turn it into a good day, but like, when I woke up, I was scared, I don't know why. I couldn't even, like, I was nervous, I was like, is this video right, is this video wrong, you know, am I doing the right thing, you know, whatever. I'm, now, let's go over the solutions, let's go over my top three solutions when you're having a dark, bad day, full of anxiety. Number one, you have to finish your task at hand. So try to get, like figure out what you need to do that day and then do it and then do a little bit more. So let's say you have a workout to do and then let's say you have a paper to write and then let's say you have a shift at work for five hours, right? Let's just have an example. You need to make sure you do all those three tasks. Let's say three tasks. Going to the gym, going to work, and finishing a paper. You need to make sure all three of those tasks are done at a top level you perform well, you get them done, and it'll give you confidence that you said, okay, we're having a bad day mentally, but now I got this done, this done, and this done, those three tasks. Therefore, you still won the day. We go back to win the day, win the day, that creates momentum. Number two, write down what scares you. Remember, I've talked about journaling in the past, it's important, but if you're having a dark day, a bad day, whatever you're thinking about, whatever's scaring you, write it down on a piece of paper, write it down in your journal, read it, Putting it in words makes it less scary, and you can conquer it at that point. So that should give you some sense of peace. And then number three, confront the fear, whatever it is. So you wrote it down, now say, how do I get over this? How do I confront it? Because remember, all the great things in life are on the other side of fear and anxiety. So guys, those are my three tips on how to get through dark days. Now guys, remember, my mistake. You guys have stayed till the end. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much. You guys stayed till the end. You made it through. Now you get to know what my mistake is. You ready? So a couple weeks ago, it was it's a YouTube mistake. I uploaded this video and I had a graphic that was wrong. It, it had some issues with it. It, was, it didn't look good. It needed some revamping, you know, some remodeling, you know, yada, yada, yada. So I, so I had to take the whole video down, go back into iMovie, the editing software that I use, redo the, the graphic, make sure it was tip-top shape, re-upload it, redo the thumbnail, redo everything, and I think it was a better version. But one of my friends that I asked for them to call me out and say, hey, you need to do this better, hey, you need to do that better, I'm sure you're gonna see this later. It's gonna be this gonna be like two months from now. We're gonna look at this, back at this and be like, huh, I'm glad, I'm glad he told me because that's gonna make my videos better. Okay guys, so basically I, I messed up the graphic on two different occasions and I had to fix it. And I mean obviously from video one to now I've made a lot of improvements and I have a long way to go, but I just wanted to tell you guys, I messed up and it's okay and I'm gonna keep going and everybody messes up. Other YouTubers mess up, in business you mess up, in school you mess up, you might get a C on a paper, you know, whatever, or you know, whatever the situation is, it's okay to fail and I failed and I get back up and I try again and just you gotta keep slow and steady wins the race. Remember that. So I hope this video gave you a little bit of hope 
to be able to persevere through bad days because I have them. Today's one of them. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna film a lot of videos. I'm gonna get a lot of work done. I'm gonna get my body moving. Maybe go take a walk. Maybe go to the gym, get on the treadmill, you know, do something and ha make it a great day. Guys, I want you to make today a great day if you're having a bad day, because I'm having a bad day today. And that's okay. All right, guys, remember, $100 Visa gift card giveaway on this channel at 1,000 family members, you know. Life's great, you know, we're doing good, we're working hard, you know, we have good days, bad days, and we're just gonna keep going, guys. Remember, slow and steady wins the race. All right, guys, that's all for today's video. Remember to continually work to become the best version of yourself. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.